Exert thy voice, sweet harbinger of spring. This moment is thy time to sing. This moment I attend to praise and set my numbers to their lays. Free as thine shall be my song, as they music short or long. Poets, wild as thee were born, pleasing best when unconfined, when to please is least designed. Soothing but their cares to rest, cares do still their thoughts molest. And still the unhappy poet's breast, like thine when best he sings, is placed against a thorn. She begins, let all be still. Muse, they promise now fulfill. Sweet, oh sweet, still sweeter yet. Can thy words such accents fit? Canst thou syllables refine? Melt a sense that shall retain Still some spirit of the brain? Till with sounds like these it join. Twill not be, then change thy note. Let division shake thy throat. Hark, division now she tries. Yet as far the muse outflies. Cease then, prithee, cease thy tune. Trifler, wilt thou sing till June? Till thy business all lies waste, and the time of buildings past? Thus we poets that have speech, unlike what they forests teach, if a fluent vein be shown, that's transcendent to our own, criticize, reform, or preach, or censor what we cannot reach.